We see Rwanda as a key element to the development of the continent of Africa. And we were um, asked by USAID to create, co-develop with the University of Rwanda, a master's program in agribusiness that targets mid-career women. The program is very important because, as you know, agriculture sector in Rwanda is very important. And if you see people involved at the small scale level, many of them are women. So we are talking about 8% of Rwandans are involved in agriculture. And you see, if you see activities on the value chain, you will find many women. So this program, it, is, it will be very important just to, to give skills to those women. They are the majority of our population. And, and they are the, the major ones that are really kind of torn between going out and go deal with their family obligation, thereby giving up their dreams of continuing their studies and bright career. And so we thought this program will actually help us to tackle that challenge. It is really important that the experts that are in the field and those working in the private sector and public sector understand how to engage those women so that they are more productive, so that they are able to more successfully complete their work, and also then to be able to enhance their livelihood. It was critical for us to be able to create a team that had that as a component. Rwanda is uh, an agriculture-based country and uh, we would like to increase our agriculture uh, from the former agriculture that our parents, our grandparents used to do, uh, survival agriculture to an improved agriculture industry. It's actually a lot of fun to think about how you engage with those um, young people in the program. They're vibrant and they're full of energy and life and it's really going to be exciting to be able to watch them move through an academic program where they're professionally developing as individuals and watching how they make the connection of how to give back and better engage in that sector and so it's my hope that you know in two years time we'll be looking at you know 42 very gainfully employed young people who are um, giving those former leaders a run for their money in terms of what it is that they're thinking about and how they're handling the problems that they face. I like to tell people that the day I will see no single woman on the street of Rwanda running with a basket on their head because people who graduate from this school, I mean from this program, we have helped those women to be actually the real entrepreneurs, then I will retire from academia. Mm -hmm. <laughs>